It's taken seven minutes longer than last year. <laughs> right. <laughs> Have we passed Lee's house or is it along that way? Just that way. along that That's way. along that one. Yeah. Yawning, staggering, <coughs> just having a little look here. Well done, you've all done very well. We've ordered the beer. Oh, so it's being pulled as you speak. Right, well, well done folks. Is that it, Mr. Crazy? You haven't lost any? <laughs> they know the score. Well, I'd like to know what the score is as well. So you have lost four. Right, OK. But, well done. He said, he said carry on. He knows he's done it so many times. Who is it? You can't. All right, OK. All right, fair enough. OK, guys. Right. You've all, have you all enjoyed it so far? Yeah. Yeah. Right, right. Uh, we've, we've, we've done a real good job. We've got around here in two hours and five minutes. Not that it's a race. <laughs> this, is, this is meant to be a, a nice take in, but the weather has been kind to us. I've got to say, all this week, yeah. it kept showing rain Friday, rain Friday. So uh, we, we were going to just go and drink ourselves stupid at the Canvey Club. That, that was, the, that was the, the alternative, but, but we're going to do that in a minute. So, <laughs> this is Canvey Heights. This is our old rubbish tip. Right, and it's the only altitude we've got at Canvey. We have to have, Canvey boys have to have oxygen when you come up here because we're just not used to it. We, we, we live below sea level. And to come with here, yeah, I can feel the thinness of the air already. Right, there we are. That's Long Horse Island out there in the marshland. And that's where Lee and I used to live just along by the sea wall here. And at the age of 11 and 12, we used to roll out to the middle island and we had a camp out there on stilts it was like a sort of cambodian type thing and you used to get in from underneath and that was our pirate hut on all of this marshland this was all our playground and garden we had a very very privileged upbringing not, not materially but it, it just gave us that adventure zone as young kids to explore and to even row from canvey island when we got a bit tougher to leon sea more up, have a cup of tea over there and get back on one tide, gave us the, the thirst for adventure, I think. So we thought it was fitting when Lee died in 94. We, we, uh, I sat down with his wife, Shirley, and we said, well, what are we going to do with his ashes? So it was decided that friends of ours from the lifeboat, we were all on the shore here and on, on, the, uh, on the Leon Sea side, and the small lifeboat chugged up and they scattered the ashes off of Long Horse Island there. So Lee's mortal remains are floating around here. They're spread here. It's where he grew up as a kid. And I feel that quite strongly. You know, I just feel he, 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 the, the presence of him are, is with us. So this is Lee's day, this is where we scattered his, his ashes. I've got to thank you all very much for coming on the walk. It's lovely to see such a great turnout and, a, and a, such a nice feeling. And this is turning quite, I couldn't stop this memorial situation if I wanted to, you know, it, it, it's, and, and I don't want to. We've all become mates over the years and, and long may it rain. So we're gonna go down, I'm shortening the job for you this year. We've got the bus there and uh, the pints are already being pulled up. So thank you all for attendance and we'll make it to the camp. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right, down there the bus should be waiting. Very good. This is where Lee, Sparko and myself was in the original South Side Jug Band. And we must have geeked in that corner there 50, 60 times in our life. And it hasn't changed much. <laughs> so uh, we're very grateful to the Canary Club uh, organisers for allowing us in. And we're very grateful to still come in it and still feel the atmosphere. So thanks very much for making a walk. I've got organised a few bits and pieces for later today. There's lots more happening. Bands tonight. An auction. right? Where there's some, and I'm going to flag up the thing. We've got a gold disc of nail practice that's going to be auctioned tonight. 
And there's a very special poster that they've made of Lee, which is a limited edition, which is what they figure will be the 300 foot statue outside the Kurzel <laughs> in South End. <laughs> when you go into the Oyster Creek, you'll, you'll, you'll see it's, it's, it's up on the right hand side and it's going to be signed by Wilco, Sparco and Figure. Sparco and Figure, unfortunately, are not going to be able to be here tonight. But Wilco will be in presence, right? Ladies and gentlemen, thanks very much for your Thank time you. and walk and I hope you do it. Chris for his inspirational leadership as always and showing us the campy as it is and was. Um, wouldn't be the same without him, so thank you, Chris. Yay.